Hello everyone, I'm back again, this time with the new yeah, Fools card. again. Return select. Um, but before we get into that, um, I passed 100 subscribers. I just want to say thank you to all of my subscribers um, for helping me reach this milestone. Um, you guys are amazing and this is all for you. And if you have any questions or just want to chat, feel free to comment. Um, with that said, let's um, get right into this. Race. I hope this button works. My, button select. my um, CPU is a bit below spec. Cars. Driver. It works fine if I just play, so hopefully it will work fine now. Media. Store. Me Driver. Right, so let's Media. just go to settings. Accessibility settings. Oh, race. Car. Me settings. Settings. Suggested line, full, braking, eight, throttle, unassist, okay, steering, so fully assisted. I have my Use steering right thumbstick to fully assisted right to navigate right the following now. text um, by chapters. I will play on Fully assisted. Fully assisted steering provides yes, strong guidance to help the car stay partially assisted. Because, normal. Left um, bumper previous group, right bumper next group, I'm not quite getting the hang of default, the B -B sensitivity of my stick yet on my controller, so... Yeah, it's a bit, uh, hidden a bit hit and miss but we'll see throttle up braking suggested line for global assist presets custom okay so sets let's go to Tr stability let's control have a look at shifting the additional assist button hold time accessibility track limit style ribbon pit entry assist slash reset to track accessibility visual ui colorblind so world colorblind visual, filter off use right thumbs ui color yeah. world colorblind filter off Use right thumbstick horizontal inputs Colour to navigate blind. the following text by chapters. Add a screen filter to compensate for color blindness. This affects game scenes, not the UI. Okay. UI colorblind mode, off. Use right thumbstick horizontal inputs to navigate the following text by chapters. This changes UI colors and can help users with color blindness use color to distinguish UI elements. Protonopia. This helps when UI increased contrast, so off. This increases the difference between the lightest and darkest parts of the UI and can help users with visual impairments use color to distinguish UI elements. Um, leave that Left bumper previous group, explore. right bumper next group, Y button reset to default, B button close. Moving backgrounds, on, by default, movement from some scenes, like gameplay or cinematics, will be seen behind menus. HUD contrast mode, off, changes the contrast of HUD elements. HUD text scaling, off, this increases the size of the text for the UI while you are in a race. Menu text size, default. Use right thumbstick horizontal, subtitles, subtitles, off, display subtitles on screen. Subtitles text size, 24, adjust, background opacity, 90, the sub, screen narrator, screen narrator, on, Tur screen narrator voice, Microsoft David, choose a voice for it's screen narration. Let's see what voices we have available. Microsoft Zira. Microsoft Mark. Microsoft. Microsoft David. Okay, so I only have three. Hello. Screen narrator volume, 100. Screen narrator speed, 60. Adjust I'm the speed of screen narration. I'm going to at 60 just so you guys can hear what's going on. Screen narrator pitch, 50. Adjust, read control type, off. Set whether or not to read the type of the focused UI element, such as button, slider, or off. value selector. Read list position, no. This is well. Read group selected, never. This is well. Read option selected, this never. This is well. Read value selected, this never. This is well. Read button hints, when different this or idle. This is well. Read button hints delay, zero. How long? In race activity feed, player joins lobby, this on, well. a quick chat, any, a notification, personal best, mm, on, yeah. a note, segment score, on, All of these. car level up, on, XP gained, on, car level up, on, a notification appears in the activity feed, XP gained, on, a note, tire and fuel wear, that on, a notification right appears in the activity feed when fuel use or tire wear reach certain thresholds. Lap skipped, on, a notification appears in the activity feed when your car is reset due to a lap skip. Race penalties, opponent only. Disqualifications, opponent only. Audio description, audio description, on. A audio description volume, 100. A speech to text, default. Text to speech, default. Blind driving assists, 
car to car collisions. No. Disabling this turns you. off car to car collisions in single player events. See, collisions with track bug. objects still occur regardless of I think of I'm setting. gonna turn this off just to make it easier for myself. Off. Um, for now. Steering guide, on. Use right thumbstick horizontal inputs to navigate the following text by chapters. The steering guide pans the engine and tire audio toward the nearest point on the suggested line. The direction of sound tells the player what direction to steer in. By default the car audio pans toward the recommended steering direction. This can be inverted with the invert steering guide option. Yeah, Note, so... The suggested line is an ideal path along the track, taking into account braking time, acceleration, turn intensity, and so on. This line is often very close to the track limits, especially leading up to and during turns. Left bumper previous group, right bumper if next I group, press, button reset to default, if you want commentary on any of left these, button audio press, commentary, the, right yeah. stick button audio cue preview. Yeah. So I can actually do this. The steering guide is one of the most important directional cues, designed to point you towards the suggested racing line, which is the fastest way around the track. It's important to note that the racing line will often take you to the very edge of the asphalt, and sometimes slightly beyond, as it points you to the quickest path through a turn. As you drive away from the line, you will hear the sound of your engine and tires pan left or right. Try to bring the car audio back to the center by making steering adjustments in the correct direction. By default, you should turn towards the sound of the car, as if you were following it around the track. However, if you would rather it feel like you are pulling the car back on track, you can easily flip the panning with the invert steering guide setting. I could do that. Now let's hear what the audio sounds like for this. Invert steering guide panning, off. Use right thumbstick horizontal inputs yeah, to navigate the, the following text by chapters. Back. Steering guide look ahead offset, 50. The steering guide looks ahead along on the track to give the driver time to react to upcoming turns. Adjusting this value changes how far along the track the system is checking. Okay, Higher values give the driver more notice of upcoming turns and more time to react. Note, lower values may result in faster lap times. Experiment with this value to find what works best. Player engine volume, 100. Tire volume, 100. Turn navigation, on. Use right thumbstick horizontal inputs to navigate the following text by chapters. Turn navigation dialog announces upcoming turn direction and severity. Turn severity is graded on a scale from 1 to 6 with lower numbers being more severe. The most severe turns, hairpin turns, are not numbered. Instead they are announced explicitly as hairpin turns. When two or more turns are close together, the whole sequence is given in advance. Examples, right 2 into right 3, or right hairpin long into left 4. Turn navigation dialog volume, 100, adjust the volume of turn navigation dialog, turn cues, on. Use right thumbstick horizontal inputs to navigate the following text by chapters. Turn cues inform the driver of their distance to an approaching turn, their progression through that turn, and when they have safely exited the turn. When approaching a turn, three short beeps of increasing pitch are played, called track countdown cues. During a turn, three turn gate cues play at the start, middle, and end of a turn. At the end of a sequence of turns, the final gate cue plays at a higher pitch. Turn cue volume, 100, adjust the volume of turn, turn cue pitch, 50, AI takeover cues, on, AI takeover cues notify the driver when the car becomes controlled by the AI and when so that I'm control is released. This occurs sounds. mainly when entering the pit lane or when using the reset to track feature. AI takeover cue volume, 100, adjust the volume of AI takeover cues. AI takeover cue pitch, 50, adjust the pitch of AI takeover cues. Deceleration cue, on. Use right thumbstick horizontal inputs to navigate the following text. Deceleration cues increase in playback rate and intensity to indicate how much the player needs to slow down for an upcoming deceleration cue volume, deceleration cue pitch, 50, deceleration cue look ahead yes, offset, sir. 50, the deceleration cues look ahead along the track to give the driver notice of when to decelerate. Adjusting the setting changes how far along the track the system is checking. Higher values give the dr track limit cues, on. Use right thumbstick horizontal inputs to navigate the following text by chapters. The track limit cues give feedback about the car's proximity and approach to the edge of the track. The cues increase in intensity as the player approaches the edge. The sound changes when the car is right on the edge and about to cross over, which would result in a dirty lap. An additional sound plays when the car goes off track, and another when the car returns to the track. Note that the car is not considered off track as long as there are two or more wheels on the track. Sometimes it is ideal to be near the track limits when approaching and making turns. Used in conjunction with the steering guide, the track limit cues can provide an understanding of the track's shape and the suggested line. Yeah, so, um, just as a side note, Dirty Lap is my middle name right now. This game really does have a steep learning curve. Um, Brandon was not kidding. Um, 
Track limit cue volume, 100, adjust the volume of track limits cues. Track limit cue pitch, 50, adjust the pitch of track limits cues. Gear indicator cues, on. Use right thumbstick horizontal inputs to navigate the following text by chapters. When changing gears with a manual transmission, gear indicator cues inform the player of what gear the car is currently in. Gear indicator cues are spoken by the screen narrator, so these share settings for volume, pitch, and speed. Left, shift up cues, on. Shift up cues volume, 100. Shift up cue pitch, 50. Shift down cues, on. Shift down cue volume, 100. Shift down cue pitch, 50. Wrong way cues, on. Wrong way cues play when the car is facing the wrong direction. Another sound plays when the car is reoriented in the correct direction. Wrong way cue volume, 100. Wrong way cue pitch, 50. Adjust the pitch of time limits, quick chat visibility, 8 seconds. Right. This deter Incoming quick chat visibility, 5 seconds. This determines how so. long quick chat messages from other players are displayed. Confirm save, save, and apply your changes. I have to say, oh, there a is a 2999. ton of Credit 750 race. Accessibility X button view car. features in this. It's jam-packed. Um, I believe, I really think um, Tintin did a great job on this. Um, and of course, we have we have Brandon to thank for um, always consulting with there for making this a very smooth experience. Um, so if it went for the guys at turn ten and well, guys and girls at turn ten and Brandon, we would not and many other. Uh, contributors along the way as well of course we would not have had this wonderful game today um, so yeah I just want to extend a, a thank you to Tintin and to all of the people who helped with this you guys are amazing cars let's get started um, with a little free play I think race I don't want to do too much of the boulders cut because yeah I kind of suck if I don't have uh, well for the moment I, I kind of suck career build your leg featured multiplayer free play any car any track so free play quick event setup pick a car pick a track setup. go race the f select car a glitter rat 2999 credit set Audi car column 3 BMW BRM I Chevrolet car columns Ford Car co Hyundai, hmm. Mercedes, Oldsmobile, Car co Porsche, Car Column 12, Stick 2019 Porsche. Porsche 911 Carrera S, Car Ooh, Level 1, yeah, your Porsche right. discount, 0%, 0 slash, changing car, Stick loading, this. quick event, eligible rental cars, 529, game time, track, random, select the track, look, circuit to Barcelona, track. Catalonia, circuit to Spa Franc or Champs, Eagle Rock Speedway, Y button reset to default, B button, Grand Oak Raceway, hmm. Hakone, Homestead Miami Speedway, Indianapolis Motor Speedway, Kyle Amy Grand Prix, track layout, Grand Prix circuit, select the specific track layout for this event, track, Kyle Amy Grand Prix circuit, L.E. Mans, circuit internet, Lime Rock Park, L, Kyle Amy Grand Prix circuit, let's take this, accept event setup, it's would you like to tough, accept these options, be okay, A button select, B button oh, cancel, uh, before we do that, track, though. Kyle Amy Grand, track layout, Gra time of day, noon, weather, random, Choose the number of laps. Three. Specify how many laps must be completed to complete oh, the race. Two. Two. One. Automatic. Automatic. One. Three. Four. Five. Six. six eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Th Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Six, Eighteen. Two. Nineteen. Twenty. Twenty laps. I doubt I'll do the entire race, but just number of drive adders. Twenty-three. Spe tw tw twenty. Nineteen. Fifteen. Bit. Fifteen. Accept event setup. Would you like to accept these options? Okay. All right. Loading. Loading. Wish me luck. I'm going to die. <laughs> This controller Loading. is seriously sensitive. Kyle Amy Grand Prix Circuit, Grand Prix Circuit. A button skip.
Typically known for its year-round great weather, most of Kayalami's rainfall happens during the warmer months, so weather conditions will be monitored closely during the race. Free play, circuit race, start race. Y button driver list, A button select. Loading. Segment score 1.0. Press Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Right too long. Press Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Oh, no, 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 no. Press Y button to rewind. Oh. Left 2 into right 3. Segment score 1.0. Uh, okay, I'm terrible at this. Uh, just to show you how it should actually be done once you're perfect with this. Pause menu. Res rewind. Photo mode. Settings. Exit. Set. Photo. Rewind. Resume. Rewind. Oh, oh, settings. Keep practicing, definitely. Settings. Suggest. Braking. AB. Uh. Throttle. Honest. Steering. Normal. Partially as. Fully assisted. Left okay. bumper previous group. Right bumper next group. Y button reset to default. B button close. I could do partially assisted, but yeah, let's do this. Confirm save, save, and apply your changes. Save. Pause menu, resume. Press Y button to rewind. I'm still controlling deceleration. And you have to decelerate. Otherwise. Segment score 2.1. Left hairpin into left thigh. Segment score 1.0. Left thigh. Right hairpin into left six. Right three. Segment score 1.0. Left hairpin into left five. Right three. Segment score 1.0. Segment score 1.0. Left three. Left 
Segment score 1.0. Last lap 30 zero, 3 minutes, 57.762 seconds. Left hairpin into right 4, left 5 into left 1. Second score 1.0. Segment score 5.0. Oh, right to long. Left one. Segment score 2.1. Three. Segment score 2.9. Level up, 100 CP. That's Segment score 1.0. Left hairpin into left 5. Left 4 into left 1.2 Left 5 Right hairpin into left 6 Right 3 Segment score 1.7 Y button to rewind. Left hairpin. Segment score 1.0. Right hairpin into left 5. Last lap 30 0, 2 minutes, 20.488 seconds. Left hairpin into right 4. Left 5 into left 1. Segment score 1.9. Press Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Right to long. Segment score 2.0. Left 2 into right 3. Segment score 1.0. Segment score 1.0. Left hairpin into left five. Segment score three point three. Left five. Right hairpin into left six. Right three. Segment score 1.0. Press Y button to rewind. Left hairpin. Segment score 1.0. Right two Segment score 1.0. Last lap 30 zero, 2 minutes, 24.563 seconds. Left hairpin into right 4, left 5 into left 1.
Segment score 1.0. Press Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Level up, 100 CP. Right too long. One. Segment score 1.0. Right too into right three. Segment score 3.9. Right. Segment score 2.9. Left hairpin into left five. Segment score 4.5. Left 5. Right hairpin into left 6. Right 3. Segment score 1.0. Y button to rewind. Left hairpin. Oh. Okay. Ballad then. Segment score 1.0. Oh. Segment score 1.5. Last lap 30 zero, 2 minutes, 36.102 seconds. Left hairpin into right 4, left 5 into left 1. Segment score 1.0. Segment score 1.0. Right too long. Left one. Segment score 5.9. Left two into right three. Segment score 4.5. Segment score 1.0. Left hairpin into left five. Segment score 2.2. Left five. Right hairpin into left six. Right three. Segment score 6.4. Press Y button to rewind. Left hairpin. Segment score 1.0. Segment score 5.6. Last lap 30 0, 2 minutes, 21.010 seconds. Left hairpin into right four. Left five into left one. Mm -hmm. 
Press Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Level up, 300 CP. Segment score 1.0. Right to long. Segment score 5.6. Alright, so what I want to quickly see and do is just try menu. to rewind. Photo mode settings. Still keep the assist settings. on. Driving suggested line. Braking. ABS on. Throttle. On assist. Steering. Fully assisted. Partially assisted. We'll take partially assisted. Left bumper previous group. Right bumper next group. Y button reset to default. B button close. Confirm save, save, and apply your changes, save. Alright. Pause menu, resume. Press Y button to rewind. Left 2 into right 3. Segment score 1.0. Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Left hairpin into left five. Press Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Left 5. Right hairpin into left 6. Right 3. Press Y button to rewind. Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Left hairpin. Segment score 1.0. Y button to rewind. Really? I'll leave it on track. Let's just show that. Press Y button to rewind. Why is it so sensitive? I think it's not sensitive enough, but it's too sensitive. Segment score 1.0. Last lap 30, 0, 4 minutes, 0, 3.879 seconds. Left hairpin into right 4, left 5 into left 1. Press Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Press Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Right to long. 
Y button to rewind. Left one. Segment score 1.0. Segment score 1.0. Press Y button to rewind. See, I'm I'm not quite getting that. Not quite getting that. Press Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Left hairpin into left thigh. Press Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Left five. Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Oh, Level up 100 that. CP. Segment score 1.0. Press Y button to rewind. Yeah, I have a lot to learn still. Press Y button to rewind. So... Segment score 1.0. Last lap 30, 0, 4 minutes, 47.671 seconds. Press Y button to rewind. Left hairpin into right 4. Left 5 into left 1. Press Y button to rewind. Uh, but yeah, it's quite fun if I could just get the hang of this, but I won't. Um. Segment score 1.0. Press Y button to rewind. Oh no. Segment score 1.0. 
Segment score 1.0. Right too long. Right too long. Right too long. Left one. Segment score 1.0. Press Y button to rewind. Yes, I'm doing a bit better. Not perfect yet, but a bit better. Left two into right three. Segment score 1.0. Press Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Left hairpin and left thigh. Press Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Left five. Press Y button to rewind. Right hairpin into left six. Right three. Press Y button to rewind. Segment score 1.0. Segment score 1.0. Right two long. 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 Right two Oh, sorry. Um, I wanted to do... Pause menu. Rewind. Photo mode. Settings. Settings. Suggested lock. Braking. A. Throttle. Uh, steering. Sorry. Partially assisted. Use. Allow me. Steering. Normal. Left. Part. Fully assisted. Stake fully assisted. Allow manual steering into pit. Traction control. On. Stability control. Okay. On. Shifting. Automatic. On. Use right thumbstick horizontal inputs to navigate the following text by chapters. Let's use automatic. the OD. automatic mode handles gear shifting for you. Manual. The manual mode manual requires mode. manual upshifting yes, and downshifting. Well. Manual with clutch. Manual. I'm not gonna do manual with clutch. Confirm save, but save, and apply your changes. Save. Do this. Pause menu. Resume. Press Y button to rewind. Reverse. First. Second. First. Oh man. Reverse. It's reverse. First. Segment score one point. Second. Last lap 30, 0, 5 minutes, 19.163 seconds. Fourth. Left hairpin into right four. Left five into left one. Loading. No, I didn't want to rewind. Sorry about that. 
So yeah, I'll keep loading. One. Rewind done. See, a button I resume from here. Not very button rewind further. B button cancel. My left hand. Um. Four. Left hairpin into right four. Left five into left one. Third. Second. Third. Segment score one point zero. Press Y button to rewind. Okay, now, ah, uh, <laughs> okay, Pause now menu. I can't do gear rewind. shift. Um, I'm out of the current mappings, and I'm not. Y button gonna... driver list. B button suggested line. Full. Breaking. A B. Throttle. Green map on, it right steering, now. Fully assisted. Even Allow though manual you can. steering into traction control, stability control, shifting, manual, automatic. Left bumper previous group. Confirm but, shifting, yeah, automatic. Use right thumbs, um, confirm right save, now. save, and apply so your changes. I'll just save. finish the race, A button select, B button cancel. I cancelled. will end my demonstration here. I'll get the hang of this, as will any of you um, starting to play right now. Um, it is doable, it just takes a long time to get the hang of Shifting, automatic. Use right thumbs, confirm save, save, and apply your changes. Save. Pause menu. Resume. Right, so let's get Press this y button to rewind. Done. Segment score 1.0. Right to long. One. Segment score 1.0. Level up, 100 CP. Left 2 into right 3. Segment score 4.6. Segment score 1.0. Left hairpin into left thigh. Segment score 4.5. Left 5. Right hairpin into left 6. Right 3. Segment score 1.3. Pen. Segment score 1.0. Yeah. Segment score 1.0. Last lap 30, 0, 2 minutes, 31.846 seconds. Left hairpin into right 4. Left 5 into left 1. Segment score 1.0. Segment score 3.4. Right to long. Left one. Segment score 1.2. Three. Segment score 1.0. Segment score 1.0. Left hairpin into left five.
Segment score 1.0. Left 5. Right hairpin into left 6. Right 3. Segment score 1.0. Hairpin. Segment score 1.0. Right hairpin into left 6. Right 3. Last lap 0, 2 minutes, 22.002 seconds. Left hairpin into right 4. Left 5 into left 1. Segment score 1.0. Segment score 1.0. Level up, 100 CP. Right to long. Left one. Segment score 1.0. Left 2 into right 3. Segment score 6.1. Right, this is getting a bit long. I think. Press Y button to rewind. Yeah. Well, not actually. There we go. But yeah, I, was th I think I'll end it here. Hope you guys Pause enjoyed, and I will y button driver list. see B button you back. again next A button time. Select. This is really good, just takes a lot of practice that I'm still trying to master. Rewind. It might be easier with the wheel, I'm not sure. Photo, setting, exit. Restart race. But anyway, I'll see you all again next time.